Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be using these brand new palettes, you guys. So let's get started. To start things off, I'm going to be using my Wet n Wild Rose Prime Water. A couple sprays to the face. Works great. Then I'm going to go ahead and grab my Maybelline Fit Me foundation while using my e.l.f. sponge. And just apply it all over. Then I'm going to get my L'Oreal concealer. Basically cover up all my dark circles that I have. And then... I'm going to go and eventually blend it all out. Okay, and then I'm going to go get my Wet n Wild um, Black Eyeliner. I'm going to go ahead and darken and shade in my eyebrows. Okay, and now that I did that to both eyebrows, I'm going to go ahead and grab my swooly brush right there. And we'll go ahead and blend it all together to make it even darker. Then I'm going to go and grab my cover stick concealer. And then I'm going to go clean up all around my eyebrow now. Next, I'm going to go ahead and grab my storybook palette. And I'm going to grab the first color that I'm going to grab is called Glow. I'm going to apply that to my eyelids as a transitional color. Okay, and after I apply those two colors, I'm going to go ahead and grab my blue uh, crease brush. And I'm going to apply both purples called Galaxy and Wild Heart and blend them together. And that's what they look like blended together now. You go, girl. Okay, and this palette came from a very special friend of mine. Thank you so much, Jesse. I'm going to be using this one. But before that, I'm going to go ahead and grab my cover stick and my tiny brush right there. And I'm going to cut my crease. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and apply this to both my eyelids. Okay, and after I did that, I'm going to go ahead and grab that pink called Wild Child from the palette. I'm going to apply that by just dabbing it on both eyelids. Okay, and again, I'm going to go back in with my cover stick, a concealer with my brush. And I'm going to um, highlight the inner corner of my eyelids now so I can add an even lighter um, color as well. I'm going to do this to both sides. Okay, and then I'm going to go back and I'm going to pick the top left color which is called Free Spirit. I want to apply that with my tiny little brush and just dab it on both corners. Okay. All right. And that's how it looks. And now I'm just simply blending it all together. Okay. Next up is I'm going to grab my black eyeliner. I'm going to apply it to my top lid. After that, I'm going to grab my mascara from Alta. Shout out to my girl Gabby. And after that is done, I'm going to go ahead and grab my new lashes from Cavalli. Then I'm going to get my contouring palette from Wet n Wild. I'm going to start contouring my face. Okay. 
Then I'm going to grab my blush from also Ulta. It's called Cherry Blossom. And now that that is done, I'm going to go ahead and grab my liquid highlighter. I absolutely love how this shows so much when I apply it. Just make sure if anybody uses a liquid highlighter, do not use a lot. <laughs> okay, and I applied it to both upper cheekbone areas. Now I'm going to grab my medium brown lip liner. I'm going to apply it to my lips. Then I'm going to grab my Life Glam Let's Do Makeup Crystal Color. Okay. Let that dry a little bit before I finish up the last step. Okay. And every time I finish up my lips, the last thing I do is that I apply a tiny bit of highlighter above the top of my lips where I have my uh, Cupid's bow at. Okay, you guys, and this is the look I went for today. Very simple, very girly, very... You know, something that we would do in quarantine, I guess you could say. <laughs> so thank you so much, you guys. Hope to see you guys soon. Be sure to make sure to give me a big, huge thumbs up. Okay. Thanks, loves. Bye.